On the hill tonight for the Giants will be the six foot three inch 230 pound right hander Mason Black. He's a rookie. Ryan Tatis and Profar here in the first inning. Well this is out to left and this is Conforto and in foul territory he makes the catch and that's how this game gets started. Here it comes swing and there's a high pop up shallow right field out goes Luciano but in comes the right fielder and that is Canna for the catch. Tatis is retired. Two out nobody on for jerks and Profar. Profar swings rips it into right field and a base hit. Two out single for Profar and now an eight game hitting streak. And that keeps the inning going now for Manny Machado. To center field, back goes Ramos at the wall. The ball's off the wall. Nearly got out of here. Manny headed for second base, and he'll get there safely. Coming around is Profar. He'll score. Padres take a one-nothing lead. So a throw that went nowhere, and that gives away the run. You got to hit somebody with that throw. And if he had, I think Profar would have stopped at third. Swing, and he smokes one high in the air, deep center. But that will stay in the yard, moving over to his left. Shy of the warning track, and Ramos makes the catch. Joe Musgrove on the mound tonight for the Padres. Time for a big bounce back for Big Smoke. Retired the first nine of the Giants he faced last time out, and then it was rat tat 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 tat. Whoa. Look out, and he hits him. So down to first goes Canna, hit batsman. Man aboard for Elliot Ramos. And a ground ball headed towards second base. Cronenworth will flip the second for one. On to first for two. Worked out great. Wasn't hit all that hard, but nicely turned. Two down. And a swing and a miss. Musgrove was down 3 0. Comes back to strike him out. The first K of the night for Musgrove. Two down, nobody on. Donovan Solano now. Lined a fair ball down the left field line, headed to the corner. Heading for second base is Solano, and he will get there cruising into second base with a two out double. Pigashoka coaxing that walk, putting two men on, and bringing up the guy who never strikes out, Luis Arias. Ground ball into the hole. It's short. Far to his right. Wisely turns around. The one hop throw to first. In time. He got him by a fraction of a step to end the inning. Matt Chapman will lead off for the Giants who trail one to nothing. Strike three call gets him looking. Well it looked like it lit up on the cutter. Oh it most certainly did right there. Second strikeout for Joe Musgrove. Good pitch. Sweeper gets him. Three strikeouts in a row for Musgrove. Two down. Now the left hand hitting Lamont Wade Jr. Now he belts this one deep down the right field line, way back there, off the bricks. The carom comes right to Tatis, and he fires it into second, and it's a long single for Lamont Way Jr. Now Bailey, who's been hitting the ball real hard like that each of his last two games. Now he swings a hard ground ball to first, and it bounces away from Solano and into foul ground down the right field line. They're at the corners now with two down. Not sure what happened to Solano at first base there. E3. Marco Luciano, the second baseman, standing in on the right side. Tying run now 90 feet away here for the Giants. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. So he gets out of the jam with his fourth strikeout. Top of the order, Canna hit by a curveball his first time. Just just it up the middle, and he's got a base hit. Canna, the leadoff man for the Giants tonight. He's been on base twice already. Now Elliot Ramos with one out. Lions the one-one into left field and making the catch in left field is Profar on the sinking line drive. Hit hard enough that Profar could come in and make the grab. Well, that was going to dunk down in front of him, but a nice catch by Profar for out number two. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Musgrove picks up his fifth strikeout. Through three. One down now. Five in a row retired by Black. Xander Bogart's grounded back to the mound in the second inning. 0 for one. Fly ball left field sending Conforto back to the track at the wall it is gone home run boogie goes boom that is a big time miss on the sweeper Xander Bogarts collects his 10th home run of the year Padres take a 2 nothing lead 2 2 he is lined to left and a base hit a two out knock for Donovan Solano is two for two in this game. 1 0 pitch lined into left center field. Ramos on the move, not going to get there. Solano advances one station and back to back two out hits for the Padres here in the fourth inning and put two men aboard for Luis Arise. The pitch and Arise, it's a sharp ground ball to second. Luciano's got it, throws the first, and that'll end the inning. John Jelly is the new pitcher for the Giants. Yeah, big tall right hander. We've seen him before. Jackson Merrill will come up with Profar at first and two down. Chopped the first up over the first baseman. Wade into right field. Heading for third is Profar. 
He'll be stopped there to second base goes Jackson Merrill. A double for Merrill, second and third with two away. Padres have a two nothing lead. They're a base hit away from maybe making it four nothing. And Jelly trying to end the inning with the same score. And Jelly comes in after. And he throws his fastball to first for the out. Patrick Bailey, last night he had a single and a double. 107 miles an hour, his double. And a sharply hit ball here. 104 miles an hour off his back. Swung on and miss. May get seven strikeouts for Joe. First out of the bottom of the fifth inning. Strike three call. He knew it takes with him the eighth strikeout for Joe Musgrove tonight. On the ground towards shortstop as Bogarts will send it to second for the four shot that ends the fifth inning. He's up Donovan Solano. Two for two. A double to left in the second. A single to left in the fourth inning. Line to left and Solano's got his third hit of the night all to left thinking two headed to second base throw will be late second double of the night for Donovan Solano three for three. Oh and one Agashioka swings off the handle rolls it to the right side Luciano to his left has got it and uh, for the first in time two down Solano advances to third base and now it'll be Luis Arise. Line in the left center field base hit for a rise from third comes Solano a rise with his first hit of the night drives in the third Padres run three nothing San Diego. There's a ground ball right side Luciano is moving the wrong way and a base hit for Fernando heading to third is a rise and he waits on deck here with two down in the inning a run in looking for more here with two outs three two pitch coming up for Profar ball four bases loaded and Manny Machado with a chance to really blow this one wide open on the ground up the middle into center field a base hit for Machado from third comes a rise here comes Fernando. Two more runs. Padres take a 6 nothing lead. Some two out thunder for San Diego. So Chapman's going to hit with two outs. 0 oh, 2 pitch. Chapman swings. It's a ground ball to short. Big hop for Xander Bogarts. He's got it. And before the first in time. A 1 2 3. Sixth inning for Joe Musgrove. We go into the top of the seventh inning with a score 5 0 Padres. New pitcher now for the Giants, Jordan Hicks. It's been a good night for Donovan Solano. Three hit night. Double to left. Single to left. Another double to left. And a run scored. Fly ball right field. And that's out of the reach of Canna. Fourth hit of the night for Solano. His third double of the night. And this time, this one goes to Rice. Four for four is Donovan Solano. Popped up first base side foul territory goes Wade and makes the catch. One hit one left. Top of the eighth. Jordan Hicks came on in the seventh inning back out there to start the eighth. We rise single to drive in a run his last time up. One for four nine to drive to deep right field struck pretty well. Canna going back and can't get it. Jumps up off the warning track and over the wall for a double. He gave that a ride. And now here is Tatis. The off pitch to Fernando. Through the right side into right field, a base hit. Luis Arise being waved around. Here comes the throw. It'll be cut off. Padres take a 6 0 lead. Second hit for Fernando as he picks up an RBI. Here is Jackson Merrill with Tatis at second, Profar at first. Towards right center field, and that will get in. It's a gapper from second. Tatis will score. Here comes Profar. He will score two more runs for the Padres. Two run double for Jackson Merrill. Eight to nothing, San Diego to the bottom of the eighth inning. Little bloop into right, and Fernando makes the catch in right field. Comes in, sliding in to make the grab. That's Platinum out there in right. You know, I thought that Fernando was going to pull up maybe, but no, he's not going to do that. He wants to get it out. He wants to get that first out. He lays out. He sells out. Nice. Donovan Walton, an infielder, is the new pitcher for San Francisco. Solano, a shot to be the first Padre ever with four doubles in a game. As Walton takes over, a fly ball to center and back to get it is McCray just into the game. Donnie Barrels made a bid there, but McCray able to track it down for out number one. Alec Jacob, the side armor, back for the ninth inning. So the Giants down to their final lap. First and third, two down. To right field, Fernando moves over and makes the catch. It'll end the ball game. Padres for the second straight night shut out the Giants. Tonight it is an eight nothing victory for the Padres. They bang out 17 hits, out hitting the Giants 17 to five, and they win the series.